Uh, the project that I'm uh, hoping to, to work through is a project that would involve uh, creating a uh, domain-specific language for law. Domain-specific languages are typically tailored to uh, the needs of a particular activity. So, for instance, in healthcare diagnosis, you might have a language which was really good at, 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 at capturing the things that doctors want to know and then how you'd move forward, or managing uh, airline reservations. There may be a, a domain specific language for that, something you could do. Uh, general business process languages uh, often can capture a lot of it, but there are frequently in, in, in a particular kind of activity, whether it's the law or something else, you know, things that are specifically done by that. We have already, in a sense, used language, uh, natural language, as I say, to extract rules from our moral intuitions. And we, 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 when you look at a statute book, it's full of, 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 of careful statements about what, they, what the statute is aimed at embodying the tests for that kind of moral statement about what people ought to do and what they ought not to do. So what would happen is that increasingly we'd be able to unleash the power of computing on specifying and then obeying and then uh, uh, understanding uh, uh, the things that law does.